What's up, beautiful people? Say hello to my brand new 2021 BMW M4 competition. What's up, guys? My name is Snooge. For the ones that are new, Welcome to the channel, consider subscribing. Hit that notification bell so every time I post you will be alerted and make sure you like the video, man. It helps me out. Say hello to my new 2021 BMW M4 competition. So beautiful, so beautiful. Comparing this to my old M4, huge drastic change. I did not know I was gonna love the car this much because that controversial grill that everyone's talking about looks so much better in person. There's a lot of mixed emotions about this grill, right? It's massive, it's out there, it makes a statement. But you gotta recognize that BMW is a trendsetter. At first when I was seeing this grill on pictures and whatnot, I was like, I don't know, man. I don't know if I feel that. I don't know if I wanna go with the new 2021 M4. When I started looking at it more and more, I started falling in love with it. Let me know in the comments if you guys feel the same way because when you see it in person, this thing is crazy. It really makes a difference. You gotta see it in person. So before you judge, see one of these in person and I promise you, you will change your mind. Damn, I'm a salesman. BMW should hire me, huh? Mm -hmm. You should go apply right now. Hi, is this BMW? Yeah, this is BMW. I was wondering if I can apply and be uh, your spokesperson for BMW. You're going to want to call uh, the HR. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. But yeah, anyway, if you don't really know much about the M4 competition, so it has more horsepower than your regular normal M4. 503 horsepower, 479 torque. Right off the bat, it got the badge. Competition. You gotta represent the black accents. And you just really pay attention, bro. Look at these vents from the indentation on the hood. Can you see that, Miguel? Mm -hmm. Can you see that, Miguel? Look at that. BMW, man, y'all y'all really did it. At first I was a hater, now I'm a lover. Competition wheels, another badge, M4 competition badge. Completely redesigned rear end as well. Holy crap, man. It kind of looked like a Lexus, but I'm just, I'm just, I'm just saying. It looks good. It comes with everything that you need. Stop. Got a little wing right here. The exhaust tips are finally big. You can actually fit your fist in there. You can actually fit your penile in there. If you guys are curious, trunk space is massive. You can definitely fit a lot of things in there. So side profile, gorgeous. Car is kind of long. When the boy be trying to bust a U-turn, I almost hit the curb sometimes. So. It still looks great, bro. We just gotta drop it a little, tint the windows. I forgot to mention, I didn't even freaking talk about the color. This color right here is called, forgive me if I'm pronouncing it wrong, Sao Paulo Yellow. Yas Marina Interior A. Wait till I get to the interior, guys. You guys are gonna be blown away. So this M4 right here does like, what, zero to 60 in like, what, 3.8? Not bad, not bad. Compare that to my Lambo. My Lambo does like 2.9. But still, two completely different cars. I am gonna drive the car, guys, so I can show you how powerful this car is. Comparing it to my last M4, this one does not lag. Once you snap that throttle, once you step on that gas, it is flying. The driving quality, the handling, the responsiveness, like this is the ultimate daily, honestly. In case you guys are curious, the price range for this car starting is, you know, in the low 70s. Uh, this one in particular is around 85K. It's because I got some extra options. Like, you know, competition package is gonna be a little more. But yeah, without further ado or say, ladies and gentlemen, let's take a look at the interior. I've never seen an interior look this good in my life. This is the best look, and I'm not being biased. I'm a very unbiased person, okay? But if you really take a look at this interior, these M carbon bucket seats, a $4,000 option. Holy smokes, dude. Come here, Miguel, come over here, bro. Pay attention to the detail, my G. If you pull this lever right here, look at that. But look at this seat, bro, carbon fiber. Soak that in, ladies and gentlemen, soak that in. That is amazing. A lot of room back there as well. Got the M badge right here, M4 badge. Yes, it lights up. The bucket seats really hug you, and I'm kind of wide. This is made for skinnier people. It's really grabbing my lats and my legs. My legs are really big. This right here, y'all never seen this feature before. Carbon fiber urinator. So when you need to use the restroom, you let it out. You let it out and it drains into here and it gives you more fuel. That makes it more efficient. I don't even know what this is for, guys. This is just aesthetic, but it looks great, right? Let me go. Hop on in, broski. This blue black Yas Marina leather is another option, a $2,500 option. Carmen Kardon sound system, and it comes stock in these. Look at all the carbon fiber, man. This can never get old. Pay attention to the detail. Representing the M on the shift knob. 
Look at the steering wheel. Carbon fiber. So beautiful. Carbon fiber paddle shifters. Amazing, man. If you're a little wider like me, just to let you know, these bucket seats might not be something that you want as an option. I'm just saying, because if you're gonna daily drive this, just put it out there in case, in case uh, anyone's curious. Everything you need to control for this display right here is right here. And the beauty is that it's also touchscreen, my G. Look at that. Vehicle status. You can check the oil, the tires, driving information, sport display. This car really got a lot of options in terms of this whole setup. You got your music, obviously. So if you go to the apps, they got an M lap timer app, which is kind of cool. You can track your, uh, this car is made for the track. You feel me? So you can start recording. You can get it in, bro. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can track your laps. Uh, got all these other apps as well which is really neat. And right in front of me in this other screen, you can also control it with this little knob right here. Control your music, volume control for the stereo. Here's another cool thing. You click setup, right? Boom. You can see the car is on efficient mode, comfort, comfort, comfort. What I want to drive in is Sport Plus. Sport Plus for the chassis. Steering is Sport, brake is Sport. And if I want to store that, right? You see this M1 right here? Just hold that and boom. Every time I click M1, it'll be all Sport Plus. This one's special, guys. So you see this, right? So cool, you can open and close the valves of your exhaust. Now it's on, see the green light? It indicates that, now it's off. Miguel, go to the back and check it out. Now it's off, I'm gonna rev it when it's off. Sounds like a Honda Civic, right? Now I'm gonna open up the valve. You hear that click? Mm -hmm. Sounds pretty good stock, right? It's not too bad, it's not too bad. You wanna go whip it real quick? You wanna drive it real quick so I can show you? Show you how good this car really is? Show you how good this performance really is? Let's go, come on, come on. Put it on M1, valves are open. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This car is fun. This car is fast. Bro, look, look how fast this car is, bro. Holy Wow, man. This drives so much better than my last M4, bro. The last, the old generation. This is it, guys. I actually enjoy driving this more than the Lambo Evo. If you got any questions about the car, feel free to comment. Make sure you guys like the video. I'm excited for all the videos and content that we're gonna make with this car. I guess in my area right now, it could be in my county that nobody has this exact spec. But yeah, just remember guys, when you want something in this life, don't you ever, 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 ever hesitate. Life is too short to not go after your dreams, to not go after your goals. You gotta go get it now. You gotta live it in now. You can't live in the past. You can't live in the future. You gotta be all there right now in the present. I don't want you guys to be 70, 80, looking back in life and being regretful and being like, why didn't I do that? Why didn't I start that business? Why didn't I chase my dream girl or dream guy? Why didn't I do this? Why didn't I try that? I want you guys to do everything you can now in this life because we are not promised tomorrow. No hesitation in the mind, you already know, no hezzy. Have that no hezzy mentality and go after everything that you want today. Love you guys, no hezzy.